Welcome to my lecture online. I thought it was so much fun trying to evaluate a function using synthetic division that we had to do at least one or maybe two more examples. So here's our first example. But notice I put the words be careful because something is different about this function. Notice it is 3x to the fourth minus 2x cubed minus 12x plus 8. It's missing the x squared term. And with synthetic division, just like with longhand division, if there's a missing term, you have to put in a placeholder for that missing term. So in this case, it's zero because there are zero x squared terms. So let's go ahead and now solve it. We find the numerical coefficients for every one of the terms. We have three, negative two. But notice here, we're going to put in the number zero for the x squared term that's missing. Then we have uh, a negative two negative 12 because I already used this x cubed, x squared, so negative 12 and plus 8. Put a line here. Here we plug in the number that we want to evaluate the function for, for x equals 2. Then we put a line over here and we drop down the first number 3. So that's what you put down right away. Notice the placeholder because we have an x squared term. So this is x to the fourth, x cubed, x squared, x to the first, and x to the zero term. So you don't need to put that there, it's just for clarification. All right, two times three is six, you put the number six there, you add them together, you get four. Two times four is eight, add them together, you get eight. Two times eight is 16, add them together, you get four. Two times four is eight, add them together, you get 16, and there's a solution. That's the number we get when we evaluate the function at x equals two, it is equal to 16. See how quick that is and how easy it is? I like this method. Now, just to make sure we did it correctly, let's check f of x equals two is equal to, let's replace every x with a two, so we get three times two to the fourth power minus two times two to the third power minus 12 times two and plus eight. So two to the fourth power, well, that's uh, two, four, eight, that's 16. That's uh, 3 times 16 minus 2 times 8 minus 12 times 2 and plus 8. So now we work this out. This is 48 minus 16 minus 24 plus 8. Oops, that's an 8. So 48 minus 16, that would be 32 minus 24. See, that's just complicated, isn't it? Well, let's see here. 48 plus 8, that's uh, 56 minus 16 minus 24. 56 minus 16 is 40 minus 24, and 40 minus 24, that's equal to 16. Ah, look, we got the same result, so we did it correctly. I like that. This is much faster, much simpler, much easier than doing it like this. Of course, if you have a calculator, who cares? You can do it any method. It's easy with a calculator, but working it out quickly like that by hand, that is definitely the superior method, and I like it. It's fun. Those coefficients, those numbers there, they're actually the coefficient if you were to divide the original f of x by x minus 2. That is correct. And you get the remainder 16. Yeah. So if you were to divide that as a remainder, does that mean it would be 16? All the other problems you ever did, if they have a remainder, what if the remainder was 0? Would that be anything? Uh, that would be, yeah, if the remainder is zero, then you evaluate the function that is actually the root. Remember, yeah. we also can find roots with this yeah. method, so that's yes. So if the remainder is zero, you actually found the root of the, of the function. And we'll show you how that works. And if you divide that by x minus two, it would be three x. Correct. So if you take three x, three x to the fourth minus two x cubed minus 12 x, plus 8 and you divide it by x minus 2 you will get so this is x to the third power right the x to the third x squared x to the first x to the zero so you'll end up with 3x cubed plus 4x squared plus 8x plus 4 plus the remainder of 16 divided by x minus 2. That's right. So that remainder gives you the value of the function when it's evaluated at x equals 2. Oh, it, it does show some significance, and you'll see in just a few videos why it works that way. <laughs>